Welcome to Call on Doc. Today, I will be reviewing a deeper understanding about COVID-19. COVID-19 caused by the novel coronavirus, SARS-CoV-2, is a highly contagious respiratory illness that emerged in late 2019. It primarily spreads through respiratory droplets and close contact to others, causing a range of symptoms from mild to severe, including fever, cough, shortness of breath, loss of taste or smell, fatigue, and body aches. Severe cases can result in pneumonia, acute respiratory distress syndrome, ARDS, and other conditions, particularly in older adults and those with underlying health conditions. With vaccines and several treatment options developed, the virus is largely seasonal, like the flu or strep throat, with the vast majority of cases being low risk. COVID tips things to avoid during the contamination and spread period, close contact with strangers, crowded spaces, sharing personal items, and touching your face. Tips. Follow travel advisories, maintain proper hygiene, contact those you've recently been in close contact with, stay home when sick, and wear a mask during an outbreak. COVID triggers. Similar to influenza and strep throat, cases of COVID become more frequent during the fall and winter months. Aside from respiratory droplets, the virus can also spread through touching contaminated surfaces and then touching the face, particularly the mouth, nose, or eyes. Common triggers for the transmission of COVID-19 include 1. Close contact, being in close proximity, within about 6 feet, to an infected person who is not wearing a mask can increase the risk of transmission, especially if they are speaking, coughing, or sneezing. 2. Indoor settings, spending time in enclosed spaces with poor ventilation, where respiratory droplets can accumulate, increases the risk of transmission. Crowded places like indoor gatherings, public transportation, and workplaces are common sources of transmission. 3. Contact with contaminated surfaces, touching surfaces or objects that have the virus on them, and then touching the face, especially the mouth, nose, or eyes, can lead to infection. 4. Respiratory droplets. Breathing in respiratory droplets expelled by an infected person through activities like talking, singing, shouting, coughing, or sneezing can transmit the virus. 5. Asymptomatic spread. Infected individuals who do not show symptoms, asymptomatic, or have mild symptoms can still spread the virus to others unknowingly. 6. Pre-symptomatic spread. People who are infected but have not yet developed symptoms, pre-symptomatic, can unknowingly transmit the virus. 7. Close personal contact. Physical contact such as hugging, shaking hands, or kissing an infected person can lead to transmission. 8. Airborne transmission. In certain situations, the virus can remain suspended in the air in tiny particles called aerosols, especially in poorly ventilated indoor spaces. 9. Large gatherings. Large gatherings, particularly where physical distancing is difficult and mask wearing is inconsistent, pose a higher risk of transmission. 10. Travel. Traveling, especially in confined spaces like airplanes, trains, or buses, can increase exposure to the virus. If you or a loved one needs help with COVID or another condition, make sure you get online treatment from a board-certified medical provider with Call on Doc.